La vida tal y como la concebimos actualmente nació oficialmente hace 40 años, cuando el ingeniero Martin Cooper inventó el teléfono móvil. Nosotros hemos tenido la oportunidad de hablar con él desde California. You have to remember that in 1973 there were no personal computers. There were no uh, uh, digital cameras. The internet did not exist. And so uh, the telephone that we had did only one thing. It talked and it listened. Think about today's cell phones. Uh, and that is would have been a miracle to us in 1973. But uh, the phone never ever have predicted that all these things would be squeezed into one small box uh, as we have today. We did believe that someday everybody would have a cell phone. Se cumplen cuatro décadas desde que este visionario cogió su Motorola de casi un kilo de peso y llamó a su competencia para decirle que el teléfono móvil ya era una realidad. I said, Go. I'm calling you from a cell phone, but a real cell phone, a personal, portable, handheld cell phone. I was silenced on the other end of the line. I think he was grinding his teeth. ¿Qué piensa Mr. Cooper de la tecnología actual? The phone that I'm using now. Uh -huh. This is a uh, Motorola Droid M, mm -hmm. but I have a new smartphone every few months because I always have to try the latest smartphone to have a phone be connected to the person. So my vision of the future phone is a phone that adapts itself to your personality. Premio Príncipe de Asturias de Investigación Científica y Técnica, a sus 85 años sigue en activo y dirige la empresa Dina LLC, una incubadora de proyectos relacionados con el desarrollo de las tecnologías. That's a big difference. So I, I hope you are right. I hope that everybody has their lives improved by the telephone.